Hello there, and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. We're here just outside the entrance to the sewers in the Foresight Dinosaur Museum, where in the last episode, Pooh didn't have such a great time, and Ness kind of got haunted by one of the stinky ghosts down there in the muck. Oh yeah, we are, I think we're ready to head back in, and we're going to head back in with a vengeance. As you can probably tell by the huge increase in HP that everyone's got. Because yeah, we have been doing more than our fair share of grinding, let me tell you, in between now and the last time I recorded. It's, probably, it's extremely excessive, I'm sure. Uh, but uh, I feel like we probably need it because my skill at this game doesn't extend too far, so being a bit over leveled is probably necessary for me. Oh yes, and I should, yeah, let's, let's go through some of the PSIs that we learned. Honestly, it's been a while since I, uh, did that, since I did the grinding, it's been about a week since I last recorded. Um, so I kind of can't remember some of the PSIs that we kind of like got over at least an hour plus of just grinding on those uh, those caterpillars in the Scarabin Desert. I'll just flick through them just in case anyone who's watching this is interested in seeing the PSIs that we got because I can't remember which ones we got. Yeah, we've got so many Omegas now. I definitely feel like we must be getting towards kind of an end game power level. I don't actually know what the maximum level is possible in this game. Uh, maybe it's level 99? I, I don't know. Who knows? I don't think we're going to be getting that high though. I'll, I have a feeling about that. Yeah, we have we have some powerful PSI on our side now. And hopefully it should be enough to see us through uh, this dungeon. So let's have a look. Yeah, we won't have to make it too far. The last time we came down here, I think we kind of got scuppered from the first enemies. But uh, let's see how we do now. Yes, it's these guys again. Yeah, the stinky ghosts. I think they gave us the most problems. I th yeah, they did something to Pooh that uh, was not fun. And I think we want to get those out of the way as soon as possible when we see them. I think Ness can go for the for the mice. Since he seems to be more physical. And Paula, yeah, I think she can go with the, the freeze on the stinky ghosts. And Jeff. What can, what, can, what can Jeff do again? Yeah, I, th I definitely think he probably needs to rest up some more and get him fixing some of those broken items. But I don't think we have to worry about that right now. Um, I guess he could just shoot the mouse and poo. Maybe he can he can do some freeze with uh, with Paula. It's not too good actually, and I thought that it would be better. <laughs> Here I am saying that we're going to be overpowered. And uh, oh, I guess we aren't. Or at least not in the way that I thought I would be. Oh yeah, Paula's... Oh, and Jeff's been cursed? Oh, come on. That's kind of unfair. Oh, but I, I guess it's, it's fair. it is fair, because they're ghosts, so of course they're going to possess us. Oh man, am I going to have to go head back and get Pooh uncursed again? Or was it Jeff this time? Yeah, it was Jeff. Oh, okay. Well, uh, I guess I'll cut and uh, <laughs> go to the hospital real quick. See you soon. Okay, and we are back. I just uh, popped to the hospital to purify Jeff. Also, I stayed over at the hotel just real quick to replenish some uh, rogue PSI that we just spent fighting in that battle. Uh, and Jeff managed to fix the thing, the broken tube that he had, and it became the spectrum beam. And that's definitely a, a quite a nice upgrade for Jeff in terms of physical attack. So I'm glad that we have that. Okay, yeah, but yeah, let's press press on. Oh, you can go down to, into the into the sewers. That's kind of gross, but uh, I'm glad that I had a look down there. I was kind of wondering if you could if you could actually go into the into the muck. And I guess we can. Let's see what's over this way first. Is that an enemy? Or is that an item? Oh, it's an item. Nice. Croissant. Oh, an, a more old body croissant from the sewers. I don't think uh, we want to be really eating that. If we can help it, but uh, I guess food is food. Yeah, so we can head down into the into the water. But is that something we really want to be doing? I suppose we will try and avoid it for now if we can. Another item? Broken iron. Man, we get more broken stuff. Okay, well, I guess we can give that to Jeff then. Broken iron. What could that be? Hmm, I'm not so sure. But I'm, I'm sure we'll find out. Uh, before long, in any case. You have to definitely keep our item, the amount of items that we have kind of like to the minimum. If I can help it, because yeah, I don't like having a 
with inventory. Since we pick up so many items, we should probably be using more items. Honestly. Now we've got to find another ghost. Please tell me this thing isn't going to curse us again. I really don't want that, honestly. Maybe we should pull out all the PSI, but uh, I kind of don't want to be using too much PSI, honestly, even though I know I probably should. We have the, the PP for it. Yeah, maybe we should, maybe let's go, we could go for, um, we can go for a, a Mega. But that kind of seems like too much. Hmm, should we do it? We could go, we could go for, a, for a Lightning. Yeah, let's go for a Lightning with Paula. We haven't used that too much, I don't think. Yeah, Jeff can shoot. Let's just hope that uh, <laughs> this thing doesn't possess anyone. Oh, we hit the mouse. Okay, that wasn't that wasn't as good as I hoped it would be. Well, the mouse is down. But please don't, please don't possess. Okay, I can take that. Because I don't think we don't think we actually have anything that can cure possession, which is rather rather annoying. Although I suppose it uh, it's not the worst thing in the world if it had to if it does happen. It's just annoying. That's all. Okay, but uh, I think yeah, we gotta head down into the drink. Oh, after we uh, fight this bug. Yeah, filthy attack roach. <laughs> okay, so it's just like a, a more disgusting version of a regular roach, if that's even possible. Yeah, but the amount of damage that we output with our physical attacks is uh, still really good, though. I'll try and keep to <laughs> using physical attacks if I can help it. That's just the way I am. Do we actually need to go this way? I'll just check if there's anything more this way. Probably not. No, we can't do anything here. I see. I will have a quick sip of tea though as we're wading through this muck. Kind of like Shawshank style. Well, I suppose it's not really like Shawshank. Because uh, that was crawling through a tube. And this is a... Uh, kind of a lot more full body, as it were. Yeah, I think everyone's going to need a shower after this. Uh, God. Honestly, I, I have a shower every day, or at least I try to, so I can't even imagine how this feels like just wading through sewage. It sounds awful. <laughs> Ugh, okay, I'm going to try and think about that. How about there's more of these guys? The mouse is running away though. Oh, but, uh, I guess not for long. Uh, yeah. These guys really like to attack in pairs, don't they? It makes things quite annoying. Okay, let's, let's go with the old plan. Let's see what Paula can do with an Omega. I'm kind of kind of curious. I don't know if we've used Omega with her before. I'm feeling we might have done, at least on screen. Um, yeah, let's have a look what this does to the ghost. That's really nice. Not as much as I was hoping for, though. I mean, it's still pretty darn good, but... Uh, I think I mentioned it does like kind of insane damage on the flavor text for the Omega. So yeah, I kind of expected to do like massive damage all the time. I guess not all enemies are weak to it though. Level 56 though for Pooh. Oh, he's getting good stat increases now. Okay, okay, okay I'll deal with that. Yeah, Pooh's moving up in the world. I mean, he used to be one of the weaker members of the party, but for. Uh, his strength has really come on leaps and bounds, I must say. I'm talking to things again. Come on, don't do that, Tom. Broken spray can, more broken stuff. I suppose it's, it's fair, considering the fact that we're in like a, a sewer and everything is going to be broken, really. Yeah. Jeff can only carry so much. Then you got one slot left after this. He's got three broken things. The broken spray, I think that becomes defense spray, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, honestly, I don't really have much use for defense spray, but I uh, will. We'll have to see what it becomes. Okay, they're both in the line, so maybe we can get Paula to use some fire. Yeah, let's go with the beta of that. I can't remember if I said the, the ghosts are weak to fire, but I suppose we'll find out. Uh, not quite, I guess. Which is unfortunate. Oh yeah, um... Okay, so long as they attack, I'm fine with it. So when they do that possession thing, I uh, get quite annoyed with them. Oh no! Oh, for God's sake, see? Speak of the devil. 
Okay, but we're not- we're gonna run with this. I don't wanna have to keep running back to the healer every time uh, <laughs> we get possessed. Oh, but can we- we can't go with a, a heal, can we? I don't think this is something we can heal away. We're just gonna have to deal with it. I mean, we can try, unless- does Pooh have a better version of heal? He does. Don't one of us. Let me just check what that does real quick. In addition to the effects of healing Gamma, this requires a friend who has become unconscious. I see, so it doesn't have anything to do with ghosts. Diamondized paralysis, yeah, nothing. We're gonna have to roll with this, I think. Which is a shame, but uh, not the worst thing in the world. Yeah, I, I, I do. Uh, I have a feeling this is gonna lead to the your sanctuary location. I just hope uh, my my theory is right. I have to... Oh, they're, they're, they're in the water as well. I kind of uh, would rather <laughs> despawn them if I can. I'm gonna mess with the RNG. Yeah, I think we can. I think we should be fine for now. Although they could be more further up. Yeah, there's a mouse there. Oh, and a trash can. Curses. Oh, more of these guys. I see. Okay. Hmm. What can we do? Yeah, I'd rather not waste PSI. Although maybe we can go ham with Paula. If we don't want to waste Nesses. You know what? Yeah, we, we can uh, splash out a little bit. Let's go with the Gamma. Oh, but that's 40. Oh, do I really want to do that? Mm. I'll go with I'll go with the Beta. Let's uh, stick with what we know. With uh, what's cheap. Okay, should we go with Freeze? And that's probably the most effective option. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's a tough call. We'll go with the gamma on the on the ghost. That's all. Yeah, we need to get rid of the ghosts first, I think, because otherwise they'll just end up possessing everyone. I don't know if only one person can be possessed though. Maybe there's like a. I don't know if everyone can be possessed or if uh, only one person. I haven't really experienced being possessed more than once. Oh, what a... It used to be Pooh that goes uh, as the whipping boy of the party. And it seems that like Paula has returned to being the one everyone dislikes. Yeah, I don't want her to get too low on health. I think Ness is just going to keep uh, refreshing her HP with uh, with life up alphas. He's such a good, a good guy, you know? Very chivalrous. It's the kind of thing he'd do. Okay, but there's one door there. I don't think we did we go in there. I don't think we did. Oh, there's so many enemies. I'm not a huge fan, honestly. Oh, there's more. Um, oh, the, the mouse is coming after us. Oh, but at least we don't have to fight the ghost this time. <laughs> this should be an easy one. Oh, but the, yeah, the, the ghost likes to try and stop us from attacking. That's right. Well, it should be a minor inconvenience at the most. Jeff, level up for Jeff, though. Eh, not too great, but uh, something's better than nothing. Yeah, that's the uh, <laughs> thing we can. Let's see if we can just do it with all physical attacks. Kind of curious. Probably not, honestly. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, sometimes it seems to do only one one damage, and sometimes it seems to do more. I wonder if that's random or not. Okay, well, yeah, should we heal everyone up? Hmm. Let's have a look at who's hurt the most. Yeah, who needs some healing? Uh, all is okay. Let's give some alpha to to Boo. Yeah, here's the way up. There was a door back here. I kind of want to see what's in there. And hopefully those enemies will despawn in a more suitable way. I guess we've got to fight these cockroaches now. Okay, we should probably kill it with fire, honestly. Probably seems like a good policy. Yeah, I haven't really thought about what the boss for this place could be. Did he say there was a giant, like, the, as he was leading us down to 
the manhole, but there was a rat down here. I could be wrong. Why am, why am I thinking there's going to be a rat? Hmm. Probably going to be some kind of rat. I mean, there's certainly enough mice around. Oh, nicely done, Paula. The bosses in this game can be uh, pretty terrifying, although we haven't had too much problem. Well, is that an enemy? Well, I kind of feel like it might not be. Yeah, that looks like an item. Rust promoted deluxe. We haven't really encountered too many robotic enemies. I've not really had much cause for the rust promoter, not that I can remember. I suppose I could have used it for for the um the clumsy robot fight back in the Monotoli building. Is, 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 is this really just a magic butterfly room? Okay, well, I guess we can take a few magic butterflies. It's kind of nice that they're giving us magic replen. It's kind of, we should probably take advantage of it whilst we can. Yeah, how much... It gives 10 each time, I think. Yeah, and Paula needs quite a bit more. Yeah, and Pooh's max. So let's get a few more for Paula's sake. Oh, the mouse was right there for that time. Well, there wasn't there wasn't one in the, that, that time. Oh, there it is now, though. Oh, once again, I feel like my commentary is... Uh, <laughs> is hardly the, the most professional. Once again. Classic Tom. Thrilling commentary from uh, yours truly. Oh, I, I feel a sneeze coming on though. Uh, pardon me if that happens. Kind of, I don't really enjoy editing too much, so I feel like I tend to keep far too much in that I don't need to, including things like this. Oh god, it's, I feel it coming. Oh, it might not come though. Okay, I don't think I need any more, any more uh, butterfly time. But I will. Should I heal everyone up? Oh, let me just check everyone's health again. Yeah, we could uh, give some finesse. Yeah, I think we should do it. Oh, I think the, the sneeze is gone though. It's good. Yeah, Mag Ness has got so much HP now, it's kind of insane. We've almost the better half of a thousand. He's become a very strong boy, just like his mother wanted. Though he's only going to only goes up from here, Ness. Uh, what's in here? Is this an empty room? I think there's something over there. It's just out of the corner of my eye. I hope it's not another broken item because uh, I think Jeff is probably tired of lugging around all this junk. Oh come on! There we go. It can't be too much further to the bar, surely. Broken, and there's more broken stuff. I thought there would be. It just seems to be a theme in this dungeon. Um, yeah, Paul has got that. Okay, well, I guess Jeff can take even more broken stuff. Sorry. <laughs> At least it will be. It will build up his muscles. I think he needs it. He's going to be the, the swollest nerd in the whole world by the time this game ends. Yeah, these guys don't seem too bad. I mean, yeah, I think we're probably much higher level than we need to be for this dungeon. But if we were lower level, I think it would be even more difficult. Yeah, because those, uh, those enemies can hit pretty hard from what we found out in the last episode. Oh, it's right there! Um, this is... okay, we've come to the end. But, uh, yeah, I think that's it. End of the road. Okay, well... I think we're I think we're in good shape, even though all is possessed. Uh, let's see. Let me just do one last health check. Hmm. Yeah, Pooh and Jeff could use a little bit of loving. Oh, we'll use one life up on on Jeff. Maybe we can use an item for Pooh. Yeah, we could go with the croissant. But this might be his first time eating actual Western food, so do enjoy Pooh. Although, I wonder, although I only recovered a little bit, did he really not need any? 
Or was it just a bad croissant? It might, it might have just been a pretty rubbish croissant. After all, it is a sewer food. Sorry, sorry about that. Uh, the first taste of Western cuisine. Not exactly the highest quality. My apologies, sir. Uh... Okay, but yeah, we got our... This is the fifth? Well, I think this is the fifth, your sanctuary location. Oh, well, let's do it. You finally got here. This is the fifth, your sanctuary location. But it's mine now. Take it from me, if you dare. Oh, I think we dare. Plague Rat of Doom, yeah, I think... I knew the, the thing you mentioned about somewhere. Oh, look at the teeth on that thing, though. That's kind of, um, kind of creepy. I don't think his head is meant to be that big. Oh, okay, well... Yeah, we gotta, we gotta play it safe. We're gonna have to have Jeff spine it, I think. Yeah, let's get everyone... Should we get everyone shielded up? I think Paula's probably gonna need more more defending this time. Although Pooh probably could use some as well. Yeah. Hang on. Did, did, I can't remember... Have I mentioned the fact that she has a prey option before? I don't think I remember seeing her. Have I mentioned that before? Yeah, she, I didn't know that you could pray with Paula. Um, I suppose we don't need to worry about that right now. I don't know why I just noticed it after all this time. Or well, have I mentioned it before? I can't remember. Classic me. Okay, we're gonna go with the Shield Omega though. Uh, Jeff, yeah, let's see what uh, it has any weaknesses. Somehow, I don't think it will though. Mm hmm, what can we do? Brain Shock? I don't think we've really had much n need to use Brain Shock recently. Uh, yeah, let's go with the Freeze. We need to do some damage, I think. Oh no, poo! Uh, see? Now the, the, the possession is becoming a problem. It could be uh, quite annoying. But we'll see. Shield, nice. More shields, always good. Yeah, it's not really weak to anything. Kind of thought so, thought as much. Okay, well, that hurt. Uh, Ness? No, we'll have, we'll have Pooh recover. Recover Jeff. Hmm. Since we can't really do anything special to it, I guess we can just go all in with the PSI? I think that's probably the, the right thing to do. Or can we use defense down? I think it's probably more prudent to use defense up for everyone rather than defense down, because it probably has protections against defense down. Yeah, can we use any specific items? I don't think we can. I don't think any of these the Hungry HP Sucker, I don't think that's going to work on a boss. Hmm. Yeah, let's just have Jeff attack. He test out his new Spectrum Beam. Poo. Yeah, let's have him heal. Let's have him heal up Jeff. Oh, excellent. I don't think we're going to be... I don't think we're going to be that much you need to use physical attacks in this fight. Maybe Ness can? But I think everyone else is... Yeah, maybe Jeff as well. Yeah, that, that only did one damage. Oh, a bit poisoned. Okay. Let's have Ness attack. I feel like Pooh could be our support for this fight. So... Let's go with a... Yeah, Freeze Omega. Sounds good to me. Jeff can attack. Yeah, and Pooh can heal... Heal Ness. Oh. Yeah, that, that ghost is a problem. So this thing doesn't seem to be doing too much to us. Oh, the, the rat, I mean. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, hang on. What do we do? Yeah. Ness needs to attack. Paula can keep plugging away with the Omega. Yeah, Jeff can attack as well. Who Do we need to heal? Ness is looking okay. I think everyone's okay for now, so... Hmm. Yeah, he, he can use freeze as well. <laughs> We're gonna freeze this rat to death. Oh yeah, and he, oh, Paula, yeah, the ghost affected Pooh again. That's annoying. Oh god, Jeff. See, it makes me think that Jeff's gonna die, but it doesn't do enough damage to actually kill him, which is a uh, comforting, if nothing else. Yeah, that's, uh, who is doing God's work here? Offer Beta and Jeff, please. 
it's nice to have someone just being able to handle all the healing and like the status uh, status recovery. Whilst everyone else just plugs away with the with the damage. Oh, nice. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that was uh, quite a cakewalk in the end. Just needed to keep on top of everything. 28k. Like <laughs> compared to the <laughs> compared to the 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 worms in the desert, it's a uh, only a little bit better. Kind of, kind of insane that the, the worms just give the same amount almost as a boss. Kind of worth using them for training. Yeah, but everyone, no, only one person can level up, I see. Okay, well that's that's that, that dungeon done. Oh, here we are. The guy was looking over the wall, I remember. Back in Foresight. But I guess now's the time to claim our inheritance. What could this one be, I wonder? Ness saw a baby's bottle, but just for an instant. Okay, that's number five. Magna Hill. I wouldn't have associated this place with magnets. I, th I just associated it with like pyramids, but I, I guess that's only one of them. Okay, but we also get an item here. Kind of reminds... it's like the... The present style from from Dalam though, a bit weird. I guess I won't question it. Carrot key. Oh, okay. I think I know what that's for. I think those are. F Is that for the rabbits back in Dalam? Yeah, we can do something with that now. I think. Um. Yeah, it's good to know that we have that option. Should we go and do that? Is that like a? Is that a hint that we have to go back to Dalam? Sounds like it might be. Yeah. I think it's probably worth doing that, since uh, I don't really have any better ideas of what to do. We can't really do anything with the pyramid, I don't think. We don't have uh, what we need for getting entry to that. Maybe that's something we'll find in Dalan? Don't know why that would be the case. Hmm. Any in any way. In any case, I should say. Um... Yeah, I think that's the best option we, that we have right now. And I'm so glad that these enemies are just running away. Oh, what am I doing? I need to get back in the juice. Oh, one. <laughs> oh, I'm accidentally clicking boss forward because I'm so used to using that to move around off screen. Oh, goodness me. That's a bad habit. Uh, yeah, it's not exactly the best habit, is it? But I'll try and uh, not to do that because that's kind of a uh, cheap. Yeah, so we're going to have to head to Dalam. I, I can't actually remember, really, what, we, what there is in Dalam. What else there is. I remember the thing with Pooh. And, like, his trials. But, uh... With, after the rabbits, uh... It all becomes a bit blank. And in, in any case, it's, uh... It's going to be interesting. Ah, oh, so many enemies that we have to avoid. Oh, we have, we have to get back in the juice again, don't we? Oh, I'm getting turned around. Yeah. Then we can, yeah, I don't think we really need to do any more grinding, even though that is naturally what I'm inclined towards doing. It's like, if I can't beat him in one hit, then uh, it's kind of a bad battle. Even though I know that's kind of a dumb way of thinking about it. Or at least in one round. Yeah, I think we're going to be fine when we have to act at alarm. But I don't think that, I think that, that's that like the only thing we can do in alarm. I don't think there was even, it was even that big of a place, really. Um, so yeah, maybe it's just worth heading on over there. Uh, if we don't have anything better to do. Yeah, the carrot key. Yeah, I think that's, that's definitely got to be the thing we have to do. Yeah, first we should probably head back to the hotel though. I think Jeff's got to be able to, to make some new items. But, but why is this happening now? We've entered this place so many times. Okay, well, you do your thing, mate. Fuzz of pickles. Yep, yeah, okay, and that was random, but uh, weirder things have happened. Yeah, so I'll, I'll have a quick rest up at the hotel, and uh, then we can move on. Yeah, I do, I do hope that Jeff can get some better items, because yeah, it's not really been too effective. 
uh, in the battles that we it kind of be the most useful. Hmm. Let's see what else he can make. If we can make anything else at all. Broken bazooka. Heavy bazooka. So is that not another upgrade for him? Man, he'd be just piling on the upgrades. If that is the case. It doesn't seem to... Oh, is this just like another random thing he can use in battle? I'm guessing that's the case. Yeah, heavy bazooka. What does this do? Heavy bazooka. Items for Jeff. Really dishes out a lot of damage to the enemy during a battle. Because of its explosive power. May affect others besides the target creature. Oh, I see. I hope that doesn't mean us. Can be used many times. Alright, well, we're going to keep keep a hold of that. Because if that's like an infinite... Kind of like good... Da <laughs> an infinite good damage machine. Yes, my vocabulary. Just uh, knows no limits, does it? Okay, well, yeah, let's... Uh, I'm going to just call my dad real quick because uh, it's become a habit at this point. Yeah, almost 100k. I think we did have over 100k at one point, but uh, not anymore. And maybe we should just call our mum real quick just in case uh, we're a little bit homesick. It doesn't seem like uh, Ness is uh, too bothered. Oh, well that's good. Yeah, so... I think we're all in pretty good shape, really. We seem to have handled that dungeon pretty well, honestly. A lot better than I thought we would. But maybe that, that's the... I mean, grinded up that much, I think uh, it's not really that surprising, really, in the end. That we, uh, <laughs> that we kind of handled that fairly well. Yeah, let's, let's just see if we can get over to Dalam. I don't think we've been... we've teleported there yet, though. So that'll be something new. Right, can we pull this off first try? Yes, we can. Excellent. Okay, yeah, here we ba here we are back in Dalam. Yeah, I think we're gonna explore more of this place with uh, with everyone this time in the next episode. I know it's not been the most fascinating of episodes, just watching me crawl through, uh, <laughs> crawl through the sewers to fight a giant rat. But uh, hey, sometimes you have fun episodes, sometimes you don't. Yeah, and I feel like my quality tends the quality of my commentary tends to vary sometimes, and I feel like today is one of those days when uh. Yeah, I'm not, not exactly the most inspired. So yeah, I must apologize for that. In any case, we're going to continue in the next episode, uh, seeing if we can do anything with this Karaki. This has been the Playfarer, and until next time, fare thee well.